I take sauce and I throw it up. But what I'm doing is, is when I cut a log, I cut this much off. And then when I come around, you take the top part, the tree ends up starting to kind of close in on itself. And then I stay underneath this to hold the tree away from my saw. So basically my action is just like this. And then I come here and then the whole entire thing falls off. So this is nice, one nice easy cut. And I don't have to try and match my cuts up. As soon as you try and match your cuts up, sometimes they're a little staggered and then your saw will stay on one side or the other side. So this, this makes it so that way there's less pinching that happens to your bar when you know which way the tree is going to, uh, going to fall after you cut it, if it has up pressure or down pressure. It has up pressure this way. You start on the bottom and basically invert this cut. So you start on the bottom and then you go to the top. If it has down pressure, so it wants to fall down, you start on the top and then go down. So easy little tip, makes it, makes it look cool when you're doing it. <laughs>